let's go SD here and welcome to Astro Colony. In the previous one we ended like this one. And I'm going to immediately skip a huge part because I want to build yeah, a little bit further. We are a little bit semi-automating everything. So in the beginning I'm really going to start with rushing this through as fast as possible. So I'm going to quickly make some stuff and then expand this one. And then we'll continue of course with all the rest. So a little bit of expansion, not much, only 4 catches, just to get this a little bit faster. So I need to make sure that I'm grabbing every time something. And this will go very good. I need to make sure we got also some yeah, carbon. So I've set up this splitter to go to the left and to the right. I know it's a little bit ugly, but this will be deleted after a while. So I also turned this one, uh, always go to the left one, not making the other one. The only reason I'm doing that is to make sure we get that technology tree up and running. We need to get that automated catcher as soon as possible. What we can do already is unlock this one. So we get the base warehouse and some iron rods. And if we can get 14, then we can do this one. And then we need 24 for the automated catcher. We got a lot of basic science, so we can do the scanner, the docker. Uh, what else maybe dehydration sure why not and then what is this human migration perfect we can already unlock signals I don't really going to use a lot of signals it's not my thing but we can unlock them uh, the booster we need to wait a little bit for that and of course we need to get that automated catcher all right, so first of all, this one is not working. There are some items in here that I'm going to grab, but the rest of this is not working. This will continue with the rest. And like you see, if I'm not doing anything, yeah, nothing is going to work. So we need to make sure every time we get something, every time we need at least two in there, just to make sure it's working. It doesn't really matter what, but I need to make sure I got some with carbon. Because if you're forgetting the carbon, then yeah, you've got a huge problem. So, alright, it's all, yeah, more and more and more. So, let's save up some points so we can expand even more. So, I wonder, are there many people still playing this game? Like me, it's still, yeah, expanding more and more. So, I wonder if there's somebody that's watching this can tell me you're still playing that. Or if you got some tips, tricks, please leave it in a comment. And of course, do a thumbs up if you can do it. So, all right, this is fine. Make sure we get all the stuff going and let me save up some more. All right, if I calculated this correct, then we can unlock this one and we can finally do the automated catcher. Wonderful, wonderful. Got five left, maybe something else. Blueprints, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, let's make that booster, sure. The booster is a good thing to yeah go a little bit faster like so crazy 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 uh, let's see we need the steel screws and we need the iron bars i think we can make the steel screws in here no we can make yeah we can make the steel screws in here but we need yeah the iron rods how do we do this can we make iron rods here oh yes so what I will do, I will bring in some resources by hand. Alright, we got some in here. So let's drop it all in here just for now. You will be the pushing the bars. And then, yes, we've got already six. And then let's say this one in here. This should go all the way around. Alright, let's take the 30. Should be enough. So I got a good tip from somebody and he told me if you're doing this and you're pressing the U, you can upgrade this one. Oh, it's already done. All right, so let's try this again. If I point at this one and I press the U button. Yeah, that's crazy. I really appreciate it. The tip is really wonderful. So if you got some more tips and tricks and all that stuff, please let me know in the comment and leave a thumbs up, of course. I really appreciate it and subscribe if you can this is really wonderful i love it i love it so you can just 
point at that one and then say you bot and you're upgrading that immediately real great i think uh, this will work then with other machines if we got the option and of course the materials so this is yeah the basic stuff got some automation going on so i'm going to expand all of that right now make sure we got a lot of catchers going on and then maybe place a building on top i'm going to push this a little bit further we got the walls unlocked so that's a really good thing and no the blocks not we got some blueprints that we can unlock that's really nice uh, then we need to do the rest but before i'm going to do the rest we need to make sure we can expand and build a lot more like you can see it's all yeah removed it's a little bit strange need to finish up some things but it's all the way up to here just this setup is enough i think we can leave this alone only thing we can do is grab some water that we're going to use and maybe some oxygen later on but for the rest this is making everything that we're going to need to yeah build the basic stuff of course so if i go all the way up to here you can see it's all compact just like that the reason why i've done this is because i don't want to move this room this is fine enough this is working it will give us power we got the water we got a nice view so there are a total 12 auto catches so and the belts can handle it i don't think there is an issue got a feeling they changed this a little bit but i don't know if that's correct uh this looks like the previous one that i made a long time ago but the other ones will be removed so yeah this is the new thing we can bring it all the way up we can make it bigger we can expand this all the way down here everything is fine it's all okay and then just yeah the power uh, it's 10 in each row so that's 20 in total that's yeah really more than enough let's see we got yeah 200 we got 94 in progress now so that's really nice this one will automatically get the resources to make the engineering signs in this box we got our plates and the copper plates if you want to build so this box is when i get some ice or carbon or anything that i don't need i can push it in there and it will go yeah to the correct place this one is only oxygen there is an option if you're using this one you can do it swap the input and an output so that's the reason why i've done it like that there is too much of ice working I know it's too much but after a while we maybe get some more so we can push it all the way in there so everything should work perfectly kind of the same design in my previous one but a little bit different i think this is looking very nice so i didn't clean up a lot so the power line like here you can see it the rest is hidden so yeah let me know what you think do you prefer just the basic one and fast forward or some more aesthetics and nice and clean build yeah this is more like basic but still clean so the power lines upstairs are all the way down here so like can see all right can you see this is how i've done it so like you see it's going to sort everything out if you don't know how to do this this is a blocker it will block the ice and the carbon this is a filter this will filter the carbon and the ice and it will go into one line just the same with this one and then it's easier yeah to manage this one will go yeah to the correct place this one is the ice that will go all the way down here and bring it back up to here with of course the correct measurements of the splitter i know i can also say one to one but i know we got three machines down there so it's three to three and in total six that's working perfect so if you got a problem with calculating that make sure you calculate the number of the machines you got and also then the carbon will go yeah through this line and of course in this line it's a total of 20 so left one 18 going forward and then one to the right and then the next one will be 16 left and right and then so on and so on all right let's check out this one quickly so 
got the problem with the power line so what I've done is you jump up and over that's just like that that's working perfectly nice so I'm now I'm going to hide this one I have, le I have left this open just to show you so like so that's closed and then that's closed and now we cannot see anything for that so that's working perfectly so yeah now we are making tons and tons of things that yeah we can expand so much that's crazy so let's see how much do i got already thousands yeah we got already 60 of the steel screws then you got of course the problem what can you do if you need some iron bars and all that stuff i temporarily place this one in here so turn this like the other side for yeah to get some iron or things that i'm going to need and if i'm done let's bring it back and then i'm going to delete it all and it's fine i got my stuff then all right let's see how much we can unlock so we got a lot of basic science that's crazy so the normal building blocks sure why not that's done then we can make the parts sure and then colonist training nice one if we want to get more science other science like chemistry and all that stuff we need the human engineering decal yeah i'm not a big fan of that because yeah for now it's just expanding and not making it nice and clean so but we can do this afterwards a nice stairs should be great to use but let's make sure we got that gravity boots. That's a nice thing. Uh, we got 30 left. We can do chemistry. Then we can go to solar panels. Oh. But we need chemistry science. Yes, of course. Space science. Yeah, we need to unlock them all. So let's see. If we don't advance docking, then we need to do space science first. And then we got not enough for the rest, but that's fine. You can make an hangar, but I'm not a big fan at these vehicles. Never tested this, so maybe something to do later on. Uh, this one is dirty, so yeah, we need to wait a little bit for that. So I told in the beginning I'm going to, to push this very fast. So for the next build, I'm going to place down there and set up just the basic stuff. And then uh, I will show you what I've done. And then, yeah, maybe we can grab some planets oh yeah just a quick thing if i need some resources i can fly all the way up here and then go in here and then do it like so yeah this drill i know that's the difference because we need this drill uh, we can unlock this drill or later on in the previous one so we got the drill a lot faster so look at that 30 27 and yeah you're almost done already 20 so and then of course if you got the resources you can do it like so you want some and make the things that yeah you want to make so there are a few in here down there is iron i think this one was uh, copper and that one is carbon so that's really easy to do but yeah these are the small ones we need to get the big ones so all right i'm going to expand more and I'm going to plan a little bit yeah yeah it's done you can see it i have done a lot this is a little bit but look at that this is massive massive but still not done really there is a lot to do the machines are not really working because i was planning to get them on the next episode i had to grab bigger planets and then yeah that should be nicer yeah it's bigger planetoids but like somewhere down there i got some small ones here and i've placed some thrusters to go a little bit yeah to where i want to go but there is a problem with this one the grabber will not always do it so if you got that problem you need to restart the game and then it should work also this docking that's something new here i see there is water you can connect to the other side that was not in the previous one and you also can set up what amount of power and water you can bring in through so i want to say three this should be three don't know why it's two but because this machine only needs three to consume and then you're only using three from the grid that's really nice 
So these belts are a little bit of a sorting belt. It's yeah, not maxed out, totally not, because yeah, we need to get that big platitoid for that. Now this is looking a little bit ugly because of the belts, but if we unlock the pipes, yeah, that should be a nicer thing. So that's it, that's yeah, the basic stuff. So if you want more explanation about all of this, please let me know in the comment. But this is going to sort everything, split everything, place them on the correct spot. These are just buffers if it's going to back up or something like that. That's why I've done this. And it's looking quite nice, quite nice. It's looking quite clean. So if you can see, I got a total one, two, three, four of these smelters. It's more than enough. I am just using two smelters to make everything like this two times and the rest will make yeah all the rest but we can get advanced smelter after yeah a um, long time and then we can change this these are the manufacturers these more these two manufacturers going to make everything in here that's just fine they can handle it so don't need to worry about that then of course our constructors these two the first uh, the last two will make then the steel screws electronic parts and the carbon fiber is this unlocked and the other two are going to make all the plates all right let's turn this back because i needed some and i got a lot now so that's nice and i'm making a lot of stuff that's crazy 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 uh, i put in this machine that it's not coming out if it's going to a storage your oxygen will not work and it needs to be in here so yeah, for some reason, even if you put it on the storage, it will not work. So it seems to be, it needs to be in here. If you got too much, you can switch it and then switch it back. to store it all in here. Like you can see, I got some hydrogen tanks. I got some hydrotonic already, just by yeah, grabbing some things in the asteroids. Or these, yeah, small planetoids stuff. So that should be fine. And these two will work just for hydrogen, hydrotonic, and after a while stone blocks hydrogen tank was needed for our boosters yeah we need to boost and we need to place them and it will cost uh, hydrogen so that's why these are temporary setups this will change after a while but for now we can yeah do a lot more we can travel to another place and then grab the rest and then of course I've placed already a, some kind of a floor here just yeah to push this for the next stage also quick thing i have filled this up totally it's looking very nice so we got more than enough water that's yeah crazy all right that's it this is already a huge expansion this will change after a while because we need to expand and unlock some technology and of course we need to bring in some bigger planetoids look at that i got 883 already 13,000 basic science that's crazy so you know what let's finish this one so we got more than enough let's do the stairs we can do the hangar and then we can unlock the biology chemistry let's do the advanced stocking sure why not uh, what is the next thing I think that's it I don't see anything that we can do we need to make yeah bring in the people and yeah make the other science so that will be a good thing to do for the next episode bringing the people grabbing big planetoids making it larger bigger nicer and yeah that's really nice also a quick thing if you're holding or uh, if you're pressing the x you get some yeah extra functions so passive tool you got the gravity boots so you can walk around jump a little bit like an astronaut yeah you're an astronaut but you can jump like you're floating a little bit so that's really nice so if you got some stairs you can walk it up and down just like a nice factory in space all right so i'm going to leave it like that i hope you enjoyed this episode for the next episode of course we're going to expand a little bit more also before i really end this i forgot to tell you we need yeah change this a little bit to organized so it's like so we got four machines here that bring in the copper asteroids or yeah that they can get four is bringing the iron two are bringing the carbon and two with ice and that's yeah more than enough to fill everything up i don't have any issue so 
seems to be fine. So, all right. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.